Hello Sagittarius, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Sagittarius, this is your reading for the month of January 2022. This is a general reading, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Okay, Sagittarius, there is an extended reading for this one and in the extended reading, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you. What action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. We'll also uh see who is a new person coming your way okay so if you're interested in the extended reading link is in the description box and in the comment section coming back to this reading on youtube sagittarius we'll see uh what is your energy what is the energy of the person you are thinking about you're dealing with what is the mutual energy between you and this person okay so let's get started now So Sagittarius, we have nine of cups for you. Then we have is three of pentacles and we have is hierophant. Interesting. Then we have is knight of wands. We have is hermit and we have is strength for your person. Mutual energy is that of wheel of fortune and we have is nine of wands. Okay. Let's pull out some romance angel cards we'll discuss the romantic messages at the fag end okay You may be dealing with a Virgo, with a Leo, with a Sagittarius, okay, or a Taurus. If the sign pops up, all the better. Let's not remain fixed on the signs, okay. Sagittarius, the month of January is the month where your confidence is going to remain at all time high, okay. And there are reasons why your confidence will be so high. I mean, it's not just confidence. You will also experience altogether a different level of happiness. Happiness, which some ecstasy happiness, which probably you had experienced only at a, as a child. Okay. You are going to experience true happiness. Your confidence is going to be amazing. Okay you are going to feel some like tremendously positive about yourself about your own life the kind of energy you are exhibiting is so positive is so charged up you are coming across as so energetic like people will not only consider consider you as inspirational personality but they will also think they will they will start blindly trusting you in whatever you're doing and whatever you're saying okay uh it's it's like people who were not ready to believe you, believe in you in whatever you were saying or doing in the past the same people are will now be trusting blindly because of the kind of confidence you will be exhibiting because of the kind of uh, you know success is going to chase you from now on is what i'm getting with that nine of cups three of pentacles and hierophant on every single domain whether it is love whether it is uh, three uh, whether it is pentacles whether it is education whether it is your own spiritual growth okay you are going to experience success everywhere okay and that is why uh, you have already started experiencing that that level of success you are already experiencing some miraculous changes transformation transition within yourself you are experiencing luck favoring you you are experiencing people starting to believe in you your efforts are getting acknowledged and validated you are attracting money okay you are already experiencing a lot of positive things in your life okay and that is why you are becoming this 
very confident person you have started believing in yourself all over again not the fact that you had stopped believing in yourself never never did you stop believing in yourself in fact you were a strong believer in yourself and that is one of the reasons why you never why you never uh, gave up on hard work why you never stopped believing in your own ideas and your philosophies and your values and you never got deterred because of the fact that people were trying to pull you down okay so what i see is that you don't have to chase anyone right now or anything right now you are in an energy where you don't have to chase love you are in an energy where you don't have to chase money you are in an energy where you don't have to chase success you are in an energy where you don't have to chase people to convince them whatever you want to tell them okay you will automatically sense love coming your way people getting attracted towards you romantically and otherwise people start considering you as an inspiration people money getting attracted towards you like if you are doing a business i see your customers increasing you are receiving a lot of orders your sales are increasing if you are in a job like your boss is going to appreciate you your boss's boss will note you uh, take a note of you your boss's boss is going to appreciate you for whatever you're doing okay if you are going to uh what shall i say uh in the, when it comes to your spiritual awakening also probably what i see is like you're going to discipline yourself a lot you may be you may start following certain certain things religiously like meditation or yoga you start take uh, taking care of your mind body and soul thoroughly okay and that is why there is a certain level of glow that will also get reflected on your face and everything is sort of contributing towards your all time high confidence it doesn't mean that after january this confidence is not going to remain of course it's going to remain okay with that higher friend someone is going to come towards you with an offer of commitment with that nine of cups you are already a wish fulfillment for someone or a wish fulfillment is about to happen for you guys three of pentacles some of you are ready to build up empire some of you may get into it's a strong indication of partnerships it's a strong indication of you coming together with someone either for romantic reasons either for business okay like all the all the areas of your life are literally shouting from the rooftop that yes we are ready to shower luck on sagittarius okay whether it is love whether it is money whether it is career it is success whether it is your spiritual awakening your spiritual journey your overall growth it's like everything is looking so positive and you're vibrating so high like you you literally don't have to go anywhere you have to sit at one place and like your soul drive is going to get attracted towards you your money is coming your way your friends are going to be like you know your past people who were not thinking good of you all of a sudden they may pop up and all of a sudden they will be like hey sagittarius what's up how are you what's going on long term long time no see okay so as you start to rise up as you start becoming more successful and more popular you will start sensing that the past people may try to come back in your life all over again they may try to flock around okay they may try to flock i mean <laughs> they may try to come back in your life okay who there is this very high level of energy in the month of january so knight of wands a hermit and the strength yes why not the past person is coming back too someone who was extremely inconsistent someone who was uh, someone who was interested in sex with you but was emotionally unavailable or they were showering emotions only till the time they were feeling passionate and once the passion was uh, got fizzled out then this person was going back and there was a strong in and out energy there was a strong inconsistent energy okay so now this person they want to reappear in your life because of course you guys had a connection right there was an emotional connection this person is sensing a shift in your energy okay with the hermit
someone who is already on the path of spiritual awakening is going to cross your paths this person may be your soulmate we have hierophant and we have hermit over here okay so i'm getting a sort of a similar energy like someone even you are on a spiritual journey even this person is on a spiritual journey <clears throat> You are coming across as more spiritually awakened, but that doesn't mean that this person doesn't have the capability to rise up. I mean, they are doing good wherever they are. This person is undergoing a transformation because they did something wrong in the past, but there is a positive transformation. Look, no one is perfect. It is only after you you experience certain things. In fact, this person, whosoever this person is in the hermit card, okay, they are, of course, they are coming your way. You, you're going to meet this person. For some of you, you may get into commitment with this person. But just to give a background of this person, what I'm feeling is like this person was into multiple relationships in the past. I mean, not multiple relationships at the same time, but yes, they had multiple partners, uh, at different times but this person with a hermit card what I'm sensing is like they are constantly trying to since the time they uh, they started understanding about they, they got an understanding about love since that time their soul is constantly trying to search you okay they know that there is someone who is meant for them in this lifetime and I'm getting a strong soulmate energy over here. Okay. And they couldn't settle down in their previous relationships. Because somewhere deep down they were knowing like whosoever they were with. That person is not their partner. Or that person is not their soulmate. They are meant to be with someone else. There was an inner calling. So in fact this person hopped from one relationship to another relationship to another relationship only for one reason because this person is continuously searching their soulmate since the time they got an understanding about love and relationships and soulmates their soul is con continuously searching you and that is one of the reasons why they couldn't settle down in in one single relationship and of course hopping from one relationship to another relationship they have created certain karma for themselves they are repaying that karma in uh, in this in this hermit mode they are in isolation right now they are trying they have been through something some traumatic situations okay some disappointment some heartbreak like this person may have broken hearts in the past and their heart also got broken down in couple of relationships and they are recouping from that they are paying that karma back by experiencing the pain this person is paying back that karma back uh, so look it <clears throat> this person is not bad nobody is bad and what i see is like this person is undergoing a major transformation rather with the strength card next to the hermit card i feel like this person is heavily protected their ancestors their spiritual team is is extremely is protecting this person big time okay the reason why they are being protected is because they are meant to take a certain path with you in this lifetime okay so whosoever this person is in fact, they are very humble, they are very down to earth and they are very grounded and uh, no fuss at all. In fact, this person is sort of successful. Professionally, they have achieved a lot more success as compared to yours. Like this person is really good when it comes to their career, when it comes to their money. Okay, there was this one area which was lacking and that was spiritual awakening. But they are catching up and they are going to catch up very soon. Let me tell you that. There will be a time in both of your life where this person is going to surpass you, even in even when it comes to spiritual journey. Okay. <clears throat> the mutual energy is that of Wheel of Fortune and Nine of Wands. So Sagittarius times are changing, and times have already changed. Probably, I'm I'm getting this energy from the month of December itself. Like there is a shift in the energy and 2022 is going to be a big year for you guys. In fact, it's a big year for many, many zodiac signs, I believe. Many of you guys are going to find someone for yourself, okay? Don't fear the change. Do not avoid the change. Change is necessary. In fact, the only thing constant is the change, okay? So accept change with open arms. Don't fear that. 
all right if this resonates hit like share and subscribe and comment down below and uh, what else uh if you're interested in extended reading link is in the description box and in the comment section in the extended reading we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you <clears throat> Uh, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person? We will also see who is a new person coming your way. Okay. So let's check out the romance angel cards now. Sagittarius. Express your love. Go ahead and make a romantic gesture. This is either applicable for you guys or someone is interested in you. You are a wish fulfillment for many anyways. Okay. So there are people interested in you. Give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. With that Hierophant card, I feel like partnership is about to happen very soon. Soulmate, yes. Yes, this is your soulmate. I told you, right? This is your soulmate. This person is your soulmate. I'm telling you. Like, wow. I'm so happy. <laughs> Whatever I said, it just got validated and confirmed. True love, this is a romance of a lifetime. Yay, I'm so happy for you, Sagittarius. It is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all i told you right change is on the horizon do not avoid the change do not fear the change okay so it is safe for you to love forgiving and learning learning someone needs your forgiveness forgive people okay it will only help you move faster in your life release your ex time has come to clear your energy yay all right i hope this resonates hit like share and subscribe and comment down below till then bye bye